Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to a next installment of our scientific exploration. So this morning, the item we need for this experiment is food coloring, which we have. Lighter colors are always good. We need some oil. We need a vase with water. And you need a paintbrush to stir when you add the food coloring to the oil. So we're gonna start that, but before we start it, let's explain to you. So this experiment is all about Miss Aisha. It's about the differences between the oil, the water, and food coloring, which is more heavy and which is more light. So at the end of the day, we're just saying to you that we are going to be infusing different liquid and we want to see which one is heavy and which one is light. So we're gonna add some food coloring to the oil. How many drops? We can few? do, f yes, four drops. Okay, let's do a few drops then. So when you drop them, the, the droplets in the oil, you're gonna use a paintbrush to stir or to mix. So we have three colors. You can choose any of your choice, but try to use the lighter colors so you can see the experiment when it goes in. So now we have infused our colors inside the oil. We're gonna use the paintbrush and we are going to mix. So upon mixing, you notice you're getting some ball and it looking so colorful. So can just imagine when you pour it in the, the jar. You can sing a song while you're mixing or you can count to 10. Good job. All right, once finished mixing, you can just take your paintbrush out and just put it on the side. Good. And now we are going to add the liquid to the water and look what happens. But at the same time, let's take a look what's inside here with the vegetable oil and also the food coloring. Oh, it becomes a little small, tiny oh. bubbles. And it's very nice. It is. Now we're adding. Wow, look at that. So we have just added the food coloring and oil to the water. So let's talk about what's happening, Miss Aisha. Mm -hmm. So here, did you see that there's an oil on top of the water? The reason being it sits on the top is because oil is lighter than water so that it will remain on the top. And as it relates to the food coloring, it is much, much heavier mm -hmm. than the oil and so forth. That's the reason why it's dispersing and ending up at the bottom of the jar. Exactly, and also oil and water do not mix. No. So that's why it sits on the top, and also food coloring and oil actually don't mix as well. That's why it's slowly spreading out into the water and then mix it with water and create some very fantastic designs that we oh, cannot imagine. Nice food works as mm -hmm. we would say for fireworks. Mm -hmm. So there you have it, boys and girls, our scientific experiment for today. We've experimented with food coloring and oil. Thank you again for stopping by, and please do take care and see you soon. Goodbye. Thank you.